Warning, I, Dan Lanks, am going to completely blow your mind during this Minecraft video. So if you enjoy console Minecraft, hit that like button and subscribe for more block placing awesomeness. Hey, what's up guys? It's Dan Lags, and I am back again for episode number four of Search and Destroy. And today's episode, um, like I said, I was going to start, where, where am I going here? I was going to start exploring this abandoned mine shaft. Uh, this is going to be a little bit risky, but you know, I'm going to do it. I don't want to die two times or back to back episodes, but yeah. Um, so I got some confirmation from Tyler and Steven. Uh, we were talking in between episodes and Tyler actually was unable to uh, regain his items. So... That's definitely interesting. I mean, I don't know if he's bluffing or not, but um, just to like kind of get me on his soft side. I mean, that's definitely a possibility. But um, yeah, so Tyler, I'm just gonna assume that Tyler didn't was unable to get his stuff. So that means Tyler's back to square one, which is huge because he had probably the best stuff. Now Steven's pretty much in the lead, but I'm not I'm not super worried about Steven to be honest. No offense to Steven, but I was a lot more worried about Tyler. All right, so let's explore this abandoned mine shaft a little bit. This is going to be a little bit dangerous because there's a lot of scary stuff in here. I'll just kill this this hopeless zombie. Okay. See, the problem with this abandoned mine shaft is there's so much water. And uh, I can't hear the spider spawners because I don't have my headset on. So I'm going to have to really pay attention to, like, everything. Alright, so I'm going to cut off this water because this is being a pain in the ass. Alright, so last episode was pretty intense, guys. Uh, if you saw it, it was got pretty crazy we got two deaths tyler and i both died and i got killed by an enderman tyler hit the ground too hard so yeah i mean it's getting a little bit uh intense so far so um hopefully you guys like the series this has actually been a ton of fun to record so far and you know we're gonna continue onward so i'm gonna in my quest to i guess to win i don't really know what the the prize is for winning but <laughs> i mean we're gonna keep killing each other it's not like it's we're gonna kill each other once and then whoever's like the last person to be alive wins it's not gonna be like hunger games it's just we're just gonna keep killing each other over and over again like just pretty much like a survival series we were, we were gonna call it rival craft what do you guys think about that name rival craft um i thought that was actually that was like the name i thought of yesterday rival craft kind of interesting let me know guys if you like rival craft i, I think i like it all right, so there's some iron right there. I saw that. Don't worry. I'm just making sure. See, look at how creepy that is with that uh, that fog. It's cool stuff. It's, I love bedrock fog. It's one of my favorite things. All right, so there's so many possibilities of so many which so many directions I could take. Uh, basically, my goal in this in the shaft is just to look for um the chests, the abandoned chests. Like that's pretty much my goal here. Um, I'm gonna try to stay nomadic for a little bit longer just to set up a little bit more um because i don't you know i just i feel like that's probably a good decision but eventually i will start setting up a house or not a house like a base and uh put some traps and everything and just try to get tyler and steven uh to catch them off guard it's all about unpredictable uh being unpredictable in this and tyler was actually mentioning that um he could use dogs he's gonna use dogs to uh, like walk around with them like so if he, just in case he gets into a fight like he'll have dogs to like prepared for him so that's definitely an interesting thought um so i'll have to take that into consideration when i'm like doing my thing because i might actually have to go try to find some dogs all right so i'm gonna go this way i'm gonna patch up this i could use a water bucket that's actually probably pretty smart i should probably get a water bucket but not right now all right let's get this lapis lazuli and of course i'm looking for diamonds right now if I could find them in the chest, that would be fantastic. But if I can't, then I can always just go down to a strip mine. So, we're good. Get some of this coal, or not coal, iron. And I gotta check what block I'm on and see what's up. Because we gotta find... We gotta find that. Uh, okay, so we're on block 11. That's interesting. So, I'm, a, I'm gonna strip this way because I don't think anyone's gonna be down here. I don't wanna run into someone else's strip mine. Because that's just, that's bad news. So I'm going to strip mine this way. Let's just get started. Let's do a little strip mining. Not the most fun thing in the world, but it's definitely the best, most efficient way to find diamonds. So I'm going to just do some strip mining. We're on block 12, right? Yes, we are. All right, so I'm just going to keep looking until I find some diamonds. Uh, I, I think that's probably a good idea. Like, once I get diamonds, that'll be a smart time to set up a base. Uh, yeah, so, okay. So we already got some redstone. That's good. Redstone is useful. I'm going to move my uh, bread and my torches right next to my pickaxe. 
So yeah. Okay, so let's continue here. Get some of that redstone. Some of that good stuff. That's XP for the win. And I will actually... I might actually use a little bit of redstone. Let me open up a spot for redstone. I don't need that stone sword. Because uh, I could use some redstone contraptions. Like uh, some like pressure plates and things like that. I don't know if, if Tyler or Steven are going to fall for pressure plates. But it's worth it. It's, it's, it's more of just a mind game than anything else. A distraction, I guess. I could like camp out by a pressure plate. Try to catch him off guard, maybe. You know, all this stuff is definitely possibilities. There's so many different ways I can... Like, ambush. I'm gonna try to... I mean, it's it's all out, man. So, the cheapest, best way to kill someone is the way I'm gonna be doing it. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, so... Let me continue onward with this strip mine. Hopefully, I can run into some diamonds. If I can, that would be absolutely fantastic. And I'm gonna try to build in an area. I'm thinking about building... I was thinking about this for a second between episodes. I'm thinking about building my base, like, in the corner of the map... So, they're, they can only come from, like, two possible directions. Well, like, in front of me, but, like, I can keep everyone, everything in front of me. Like, so I don't get, um, backstabbed, because that would suck. And, also, we are actually confirmed by Tyler. We're on the nighttime of day seven of the, um, of the grace period. So, only maybe a couple more episodes right now. We're on episode four, I believe. And, probably episode five will most likely be the last episode of the grace period and then it's gonna it's gonna start getting some pretty spicy it's gonna be some good stuff all right so let's keep on digging here just trying to find some of these diamonds I really would love to find some diamonds that would be fantastic just I know Steven Steven hasn't been saying much so I know he's he's doing good Tyler's dead so he's he's not a factor right now but he will be I I, I can't you can't underestimate Tyler he is he's good at survival so I'm Tyler is the number one threat here. And I know he's going to, even though he lost his, all of his stuff, I know he's going to be able to get back to a prominent state. So we, we got, we got issues, but we're going to, we're going to try our best here. Okay. So there's some lava. This is where I would like to have a water bucket. Let's make sure nothing's behind me. Okay. So I'm just going to cover this up. See, that would be the worst way to die. If someone push you into lava. Like that's why I'm so, I'm always checking behind me just in case. I mean, I know they can't do it right now because it's the grace period, but I've been killed by zombies coming up behind me and pushing me into lava before, so I don't want that to happen. Okay, so I'm going to grab that block right... Actually, no. That block right there. There we go. Okay, so lava, lava, lava. Nobody likes you. Okay, well, we, we're opening up into a cave. That's interesting. All right, well, this would probably be a good spot to look for some diamonds. Be an excellent spot to look for some diamonds. So I'll check it out. I'll walk over here for a second. See if I can find any diamonds. This, this bedrock fog is intense. Holy crap. Look what we have here. Oh, there's diamonds. Oh, let's go. All right, so now we have to be real careful because this is a ravine and ravines are super dangerous so okay we have water over there that's what i'm really looking for okay there's water right here actually okay this is this is what i want right here aha okay great so i can make a i'm gonna make a uh put my crafting table down and where's my crafting table did i leave it somewhere i might have all right whatever i can just make another one and i i have a totally full inventory i need gunpowder i don't need lapis lazuli i don't really need gold I don't need all this coal. That's just too much coal. Okay, so where's my crafting table? Okay, now I can make a crafting table. And let me put it down right here. Okay, so I need to make myself another bucket. I need to grab that water. See, sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, I can leave that crafting table there for now. Cause I'm gonna, I'm gonna be here for a while, so. This is, this is the kind of stuff I'm looking for right here. Now, if I could just look up and see a stronghold, that would be that would make my day. I, I don't think so. Just gotta cover up all this lava. It's, we don't want we don't want to get killed by lava. That would be that'd be bad. I, I don't, it's this this area of the map. Let's check where we are. Yeah, this this could have been explored. I mean, this could be a potential like 
stronghold. I don't know. I, I can't really see up there because of the bedrock fog. But let's get these diamonds. So let me just dig around it. That way I, I know that. I know I can get them. Alright, so also I need to get rid of something. Let's just get rid of some stuff real quick. That I don't need. That I don't need. Uh, seeds I need. Sand I don't need that. Uh, gold I don't need that. Bones I definitely need that. Too much cobblestone I don't need all of it. So okay, so let's. So now I have plenty of space in my inventory for these diamonds. Oh, we have ourselves a nice little um, find here. We got at least four. That's good. That makes I can make a pickaxe. Just gonna make. Just gonna dig all the way around just to make sure. And did I. Okay, I still have another pickaxe. Cool. Could you imagine if like somebody came down and just like jacked these diamonds? Oh, there's a there's a fifth diamond, sweet. And there's some iron here too, awesome. I'll, I'll worry about that later. Okay, let's start mining these. Okay, there's one, two, three, four. Oh, oh, oh! I wouldn't be surprised to see him rage quit. He definitely lost his stuff. Oh man, X console went up in flames. Wow. Oh. Oh my gosh, that puts me in the... <laughs> oh, that's funny stuff. <laughs> Alright, I'll invite him back because he's he has to he, has, he can't be a sore loser. Tyler didn't, Tyler didn't rage quit, so Steven's not going to rage quit. If Steven doesn't come back, then he's getting kicked from the series, and we're going to get somebody else because it's, Steven's a sore loser. God, okay, that puts me in the lead now. Okay, so now I'm feeling a little bit confident. I just found some diamonds. So I didn't, I didn't, I didn't lose my, I didn't lose my cool when I got killed by that Enderman last episode, and all of a sudden I'm, I'm in the lead. So this is good stuff. Now let's not, let's not totally blow that and fall in the lava like Steven did. So let's just cover up this whole lava area. <laughs> he rejoined. Good sport, good sport. Everybody, give a round of applause for Steven for rejoining. All right, so uh, I mean, I would have been pissed if I got killed by lava because, like, at least you have a chance to get yourself back when you get killed by something else. But lava. It, no mercy. No mercy. That's why we gotta cover all this shit up. <laughs> oh man. I love I love playing survival. This, this kind of survival is actually pretty fun though, I will admit. Okay, so make sure all this lava is covered up. I don't wanna I don't wanna have to even take a chance with any of this. Like not even a one by one hole like that. Like just, we're not even gonna take a chance. Okay, so I'm looking at that little that redstone right there for some XP. So let's cover this up. Grab my bucket. All right, let's go up here. So I have these diamonds, right? Yeah, okay, I have five diamonds. I can make myself a pick, that's good. I'm gonna do that right now because that'll help me with my pursuit of more diamonds because, you know, we have to consider the exponential growth of a diamond pick and, holy, I thought, okay, for a second I thought I saw a stronghold. Here, let's go up here a little bit so we can get a better view of what's what's going up on up here because I'm pretty sure this ravine has not been explored yet by anybody but me. So we wanna take a good, better look at it from up here so if I could just get up this water he rage quit <laughs> I'm good thing he joined back though alright that doesn't look like there's a stronghold in this ravine this this goes all the way up alright I'm gonna go back down and continue my strip mining because uh, you know, that's what I need to do right now that's priority numero uno alright so Let's, what am I, what block am I on right now? 12, okay, cool. Let me grab my crafting table, and I'm going to continue. Oh, crap. My God, that scared the crap out of me. Oh. Okay, all right. Take a deep breath. Gosh, this game. All right, so. Whew. That was, that was a close one. All right, I'm going to go this way. See, I'm going to strip mine from right here. Let's just let's just hope there's more diamonds in this path. Gosh, that creeper! I know they wasn't gonna do too much damage to me because I have the armor, but whew, man, that's 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 not good. That's gonna give me a heart attack right there. All right, wow, oh, water! Thank God I have this. Okay, <laughs> this series is getting intense. We've all three of us have died. It's, all, it's an even playing field. I have a slight advantage because I'm I've I've lived. Okay, yep. Let's not let's not just all right, let's let's not kill myself here. Yeah, gotta be uh gotta stay I gotta stay humble here. I I got a slight advantage, but that doesn't mean sh that doesn't mean anything when I have uh you know 
this just lava everywhere. Okay, so let's grab this coal. This will be useful. Not coal. Why do I keep saying coal? That's coal. <laughs> All right, I'm 17, so um, that's good. Level 17, almost 18. Level 30 would be nice pretty soon. So, of course, I need to get a sugarcane farm started once I hit 30. I'll probably do that like beforehand just so I don't need the rest of that coal. So let's just go. Let's just keep moving. Yeah, but that's... uh. Yeah, that's definitely a priority, uh, sugarcane farm, so I can make some bookshelves because, you know, I, I need to go up and actually get some more wood as well, so. I also need to start thinking about getting a chest because, you know, I need to actually drop some stuff because my inventory is almost full. Let me see if there's any, like, duplicates or anything. It doesn't look, I can actually put these, tor I can compound these torches right now. Okay, didn't want to do that. Nope, no, give me, give me, give me my pickaxe, thank you. Give me that redstone. All right. So, what are we at right now? Okay, so I was looking at the timer, and a freaking lava pit just appears right in front of me. So, this game, man, is just looking to kill me. This mat, this seed is treacherous. All right, we're at almost 17 minutes. So, yeah, once the, uh, you know, we'll, we'll, 20 minute episodes. That's that's the plan. We will go for a couple more minutes. Maybe I can find some more diamonds. And yeah. And the reason why, like, I'm thinking, of, I was starting to put, like, um, a, like, a title of the video, like, giving away something, like, in the episode, like, a, like, a very brief summary of the episode. I'll start doing that now, but I'm probably not gonna put, on this episode, I'm probably not gonna put, like, I found diamonds in the title, because, um, you know, I don't want Steven to see that and be like, oh, I mean, even though it's kind of obvious, but, I mean, everyone's gonna find diamonds eventually, but you know what I mean. I might do that, but I don't know yet, I haven't decided. There's some more iron actually. Grab that. That's that's useful. Good for good for everything. It's all around good. Alright, so yeah, so priorities, sugarcane farm, uh, setting up a base of obviously more diamonds as we continue onward through this grace period of search and destroy. Or rival craft, let me know. Let me know if you like rival craft. I like that name. I think I like it. I think I might actually make it rival craft. Um Instead of search and destroy, but well, you, you guys can let me know in the comments section below. Also, click the like button. <laughs> All right, so let's continue strip mining here. I don't even like. Yeah, okay. I'm heading. I'm heading back down towards this this area of the map. So that's that's good. Got plenty of torches. Uh, I'll just keep going until I run out of torches. I guess. I'm gonna make my diamond pickaxe soon. Almost level twenty. Sugarcane farm, creating a base. Hopefully, I can find w at least one more little vein of diamonds in this run. That would be that'd be great. Uh, yeah. So yeah, let's continue. I don't even know if I'm gonna enchant a diamond sword. I, I'm a, or, sorry, not a diamond sword. A a diamond pickaxe. I mean, I probably will because they're like so useful. But I mean, the priority is is chest plate. That's definitely the priority for me in terms of enchanting so okay so now i'm all out so i'm gonna go ahead and place my crafting table did i take it okay i guess i left it but that's no big deal i can just make another one i keep having to make more and more crafting tables okay so i can get rid of some of this redstone and now crafting table and place that real quick make myself a oh, wait hold on gotta get some of these sticks just don't have enough room for all this stuff right now. I have so much coal. I have so much iron in it. I'll probably smelt the iron. Look at the iron smelted right now. Uh, okay, so sticks and diamond pick. There we go. And I don't need... I can just get rid of some cobble. Get rid of some dirt. There we go. Alright, so I got my pickaxe. All ready to go here. Diamond pick... Got two more diamonds remaining. Um, what else can I do right now? I'm gonna smelt some stuff. So let's go. Let's put down some uh, some furnaces. You just break some area in this wall so I can place some furnaces down and start get some stuff smelted. That's probably where I'll end the episode. Um, if anything, I might. I, I'm not gonna do any of the smelting off camera. I'm not gonna do anything off camera because that's not fair to Tyler and Steven. So, um, but yeah, I mean. Smelting, I need to, it's going to take me a minute to smelt this stuff. So I might just like dig out an area here just to look around. Like I'll just keep going down this strip mine. 
Maybe I'll close that up right there. Actually, you know what I should do? I should put smooth stone there. Like, just kind of like, just in case they do run into me, I can, I can, it'll look like I hadn't gone through it. Like, I had not gone that far. Like, I just, like, I just stopped. I mean, I don't know if that's going to stop them from going right through there, but I mean, hey, could be a second guess kind of thing. So, uh, guys, we're going to end the episode right here. Uh, thank you guys very much for watching. I'm going to have a very tiny spot here, but guys, thanks for watching episode number four, right? Yeah, episode four of uh, Search and Destroy or maybe Rivalcraft now is going to be the cool new name for it. Um, guys, click the like button if you did enjoy it. Support the series. It's getting pretty intense. We're almost to the end of the grace period. And then shit is going to go down. So, guys, it's been Dan Lags. And, uh, obviously, I am Loda Next Console. And I'll talk to you guys on the next episode. Peace out.